Hello everybody and welcome to hole number 6, a par 5 of the Sequoia Creek in the Grand Forest Tournament. Also a hole on tour number 10, the Club Oceania. Video sponsored by Golf Clash and Playdemic. And before we start, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Also visit golfclashtommy.com for more Golf Clash related content for free. Last but not least, get the best guys on the market by going to patreon.com slash golfclashtommy. Link directly in the description down below. So let's take a look at hole number 6 and here I do decide to play with a berserker ball as a start. Have in mind that you can play with a power 3 ball if you want to as well but to maximize the, the, maximize the power especially for the second shot a berserker ball will be very helpful. Here I'm adding topspin. First and foremost I'm adding topspin and maximum side spin to the right and using the quarterback. And the reason I'm using the quarterback is to get the ball guideline, get the accuracy uh, and so I make sure that I'm, even with a great ball, I'm not going to have any problem getting the ball to where I'm aiming. Maximum distance plus 20, we bounce on the fairway into the rough and roll out on the other fairway. And in the end, we're using half a ball of curl to the right as well. Getting it down there on the fairway, second shot is going to be with a wood club towards the pin. If you do have a sniper level 9+, plus, playing with a power 5 ball, play with the sniper. If you do not have a sniper level 9+, plus, and you have a lower level, play with the big dog or the cataclysm for that matter to have more power. If you do play with a power 3 ball, then always play with the big dog or the cataclysm to prevent yourself from having to go with overpower. Gonna bounce on the fairway, bounce the ball down towards the pin, and we get that one very close to making an albatross. But the thing here for this shot is look how far down we are bouncing from the first bounce down towards the pin. It's such a big leap down there, and in the end, the ball will be affected a lot by the wind when the, when the ball is in the air after the first bounce as well. So it's a very difficult one to dial in in a good way. However, though. There is still a chance, and the best chance is to play with the sniper. The video here is sponsored by Golf Clash and Play Demic. A massive thank you for watching, and good luck in your Golf Clash game.